Welcome back to Primetime Sports Monday. President of the MVP Track and Field Club, Bruce James, has sought to allay fears over the form of Olympic double sprint champion Elaine Thompson following her third place finish at the IAAF Diamond League meet in Oregon on Saturday. Thompson clocked a season's best 21.98 seconds to finish behind American Tori Bowie and Bahamian Shawnee Miller Weibo at the Prefontaine Classic at the weekend, her first loss of the season. But James says he is not concerned. Elaine Thompson in 2016 finished third at this very same Eugene Diamond League meeting, running 22.16 with an aiding wind of positive 1.9. This weekend, 2017, she finished third again, running 21.98 with a positive plus 1.5 wind. Last year, she went on to win gold at the Olympic Games in Rio uh, months after this performance, the 22.16, and she's way ahead of where she was. Uh, last year. So uh, we're very happy that she's going to continue doing well for 2017. James also addressed concerns over possible injury. All athletes are always pushing the body to the max and it's clear to me and everyone who saw the race that at 21.98, Lane Thompson is way ahead of where she was in 2016. Meanwhile, former world champion and Olympic silver medalist turned broadcaster Atto Bolden says he is not concerned about Thompson's form heading into this summer's world championships in London. Bolden was speaking on Hits 92 FM's Girls Sports Club this afternoon. As regards Elaine, I have some information that Elaine was not 100%, um, but in this sport, if you line up, no excuses. And she lost, um, she lost a phenomenal performance. She obviously didn't look herself, and anybody who has been watching Elaine, myself included, knows that Elaine would be fine. She hasn't lost in a year, and she's human, and um, she didn't. that's the same position that she got last year. Bolden also praised the effort of Tori Bowie in winning the 200 in a world leading 21.77 seconds, but said one specific performance stood out. To me, the big revelation in that race, Shawnee Miller-Webo running 21.9. Because when you have the Olympic 400 meter champion running 21.9, mm -hmm. people who know this sport realize what that means. Yes. And we'll be attempting a, a 4-2 double in London. Jamaica's 2011 World Championship 4x400 meter relay medalist Riker Hilton begins his fight to escape a four-year ban on Tuesday before the independent anti-doping disciplinary panel. Hilton, a 400-meter semi-finalist from the 2011 World Championships, is facing a charge of evading or refusing to provide a urine sample to the Jamaica Anti-Doping Commission for testing on April 27, 2016 at the Stadium East track. Hilton is to be represented by Dr. Amir Crown, while Laxon Robinson will be the prosecuting or prosecuting the case for JADCO. The three-member panel is chaired by Queen's Counsel Georgia Gibson-Henlin, with the hearing set to start at 10 a.m. at the Jamaica Conference Centre.